this fall, this August, I should say, and that may have you thinking fall. And some have noticed what they believe to be some early fall color in the trees out there. So is that even possible in late August? Meteorologist Carol Erickson went to the experts to find out if our eyes are deceiving us. Okay. Yvonne doesn't wonder where the yellow went. She knows it's underfoot in her usually green summer lawn, making her think fall has taken over all over the yard. The season seemed to be coming early. I don't know if it's because of the weird summer that we have been having or whatever. Actually, whatever is the better answer to the red to dead and other fall fooling changes on shrubs and trees right now. Fall's not the reason for a lot of these things that we're seeing. It's just problems that are here every year and fall gets the credit for it. Certified arborist Mike Shanai from Bartlett Tree Experts instead wants the blame for the usual summer leaf change not on weather but on the root cause of it, insects, disease and us. Sometimes it's putting a patio right over the root system. Or dumping all that mulch at the base of trees where it shouldn't be or over pruning or lawnmower run-ins. All that is fixable but if it isn't things like white scale or ash bark beetle holes and more will take over. Changing leaves before killing trees. Sometimes the damage can't be cured now. You have to notice it now and then cure it in the spring. Many out in the wild trees still look like summer. No fall color change. But notice what can happen the closer trees get to man. This out in the open ash tree looks perfect. But the ash tree across the paved street in the neighborhood, a sickly version that needs human intervention to undo human intervention. Sometimes loving them to death, allowing the insects and diseases to have an easier time with them. And masquerade the problem with some so-called early fall color. In Burlington, Carol Erickson, CBS3 Eyewitness News.